Hello everyone and welcome to Fix and Action YouTube channel. So today we will be power washing or resetting our Chromebook. So for this method, all we have to press and hold four keys. But before we doing that, please make sure you copy all your important data and uh, make sure you remember your Google account or Gmail account. Um, otherwise, you will need to create a new Google account for getting back to your Chromebook and you may lose all your data so make sure copy your data so to get started first of all you have to sign out from your account let me sign out and once you sign out you will see the screen so you will see a sign in screen something like this so as soon you can see a sign in screen or something like this we were signed in as a guest so that's why we're seeing this screen so all you have to press and hold alt control shift and r so once you press that you will see this reset this chromebook so after that you will press the restart button so again let's cancel this let me show you again alt Control shift and R so the button R So as soon as you press that you will see the screen So it's telling you reset this Chromebook a restart is required to begin the power wash Process after restart you will be asked to confirm that you want to proceed So now let's restart So make sure you copy your data if you haven't copied your data so don't do this it will delete and remove all your important data so please make sure copy your important data before you doing this so now as you can see we got a again the same message or different one so we got a message it's telling us reset this chromebook power wash to reset your chromebook to be just like new all user accounts and local data will be removed so make sure you copy your data before you're pressing power wash so now let's continue it's giving us again a warning to confirm your device will be reset in all user accounts in local data will be removed this cannot be undone so once you press continue then it will be power washed and your computer will be like a new so it will work like a new computer so usually we use this power wash or resetting method if your computer is uh, slower acting very slow or if we're trying to resell our um, chromebook so we can use this method power wash method so it got restarted again so now you will see the screen after it gets restarted so you will see the screen so this says, do you want to activate Chromebox, the built-in screen reader for Chrome operating system? So you can activate this built-in Chrome uh, built-in screen reader. So let's activate that one also. Chromebox spoken feed. Welcome to Chromebox. So Chromebox now spoken exit feedback tutorial. Is ready. Welcome to the Chromebox tutorial. So let's to exit this to accessibility deactivate settings. this dialogue. So now we have deactivated so all you have to press in press on accessibility and then turn off this you can turn on or turn off Chromebox spoken. welcome to Chromebox so let's Chromebox exit spoken feedback is ready. and turn off so now that feature is now back turned off so now let's connect with our Wi-Fi Let's press next if it's not for a child. Now we can create a new one or we can put our old Google account. But let's continue as a guest. So now you can see that we have successfully power washed our Chromebook. So I hope this method will help you how to power wash or reset your Chromebook. 
if it really helped you please don't forget to like share and subscribe for more videos thank you